prosecuting authorities in Heilongjiang revealed the details of the case late Tuesday. Wang Dong, a prisoner at the Nehe prison in the city of Tsuzhar, reportedly used WeChat, a popular mobile chat application, to threaten women living near the prison with the possibility of disseminating nude videos and photos. He was able to blackmail two of the women for a total of 18,000 U.S. dollars, according to local authorities. Mobile phones are banned in Chinese prisons. The fact that Wang was able to smuggle in and use phones has resulted in complaints about lack of security and possible corruption within the prison. One of the victims, a woman surnamed Li, managed to sneak the phone into the prison when she visited Wang Dong in August 2014. She also left two more phones sealed in a plastic bag at a vegetable shop outside the prison. One of the prison's guards was able to bring the phones into the prison and give them to another inmate, who gave them to Wang. Wang managed to obtain nude photos from two of the women and convinced them to visit him in prison in June 2014. One of the women claimed that Wang had sexual intercourse with her in the prison, but Wang denied the accusation. The prison's guards said they saw nothing of the sort. Investigators were unable to recover footage from the prison surveillance cameras because the alleged activity occurred too long ago. A Shanghai-based newspaper investigating the case said it has obtained telephone records indicating that Wang and the woman had sex in the prison. Some women managed to visit Wang by pretending to be his sister or cousin. One of them got a visitation permit through a police officer that stated that she was Wang's wife. We have since disciplined the officer in question. The prison's governor and political commissar have been removed from their posts, while another 12 prison officials have been disciplined. Three guards are being investigated for suspected negligence and abuse of power.